So you lost your navigator. You wouldn't be watching this video if you hadn't. But basically, people lose tools easily. And when you first start, it's very frustrating to find out where do I restore these things. So you could be just thinking, maybe uh, like uh, to find out what happens if I hit this. And of course, then it's gone. And how do I get it back? Or you're just drawing and uh, you accidentally hit that. And if you've ever watched any of our training videos, you know how affectionate I am towards my navigator, so I feel very badly for you. But to restore a lost navigator, you go to the Windows uh, window, you go to Palette, and select Navigator, and it's back. So it's not a big serious thing, but if you don't know where to go, that's a, that is uh, makes it difficult. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of this. If you didn't know what that was, that is an info box. That happens quite a bit too. So again, up to Windows, Palettes, and turn on the info box. Toolbox is labeled, so that's pretty easy. But when you lose things on the screen, uh, you want to go to Window, and you have um, toolbars, and we only have the Mini Navigator and the Standard on uh, most of the time. And you can customize that later after you know all the tools that are available and you have uh, the palettes and so there's a lot of things that you might uh, enjoy turning on uh, as you learn more especially for instance if you're an, um, doing a project and you have a lot of favorite um, wall styles that would be one that you might want to have up I find that learning a software program is very similar to learning a foreign language after teaching for over, well over 24, 25 years at a community college, I found that people that interpret a language in their head do, don't do as well as people that think in English. So in other words, like if I was German and uh, I wanted to say, uh, what's up in English, I would think, wie geht's, and then I would interpret that to what's up. And so you have to learn to know that when you go here, it does a certain thing, or this means a certain thing. So again, that's learning a language. So of course, the more you use it, the more you practice, uh, the better you will be. This is Stephanie Kwame from the CAD Academy. Auf Wiedersehen.